The hype has been around sea salt sprays for quite some time now, and I've had Tidal Wave probably very, very early on when I first created my product line, the Salon Guy product line. And over the last, I think it was about maybe eight months ago, seven months ago, maybe a little bit longer, we redid Tidal Wave to have uh, a lot of improvements. And I feel like this is the best sea salt spray. Okay, it's our number one selling product and it's just an incredible product. Now, I wanna go over how to use sea salt spray properly because I've, you know, gotten feedback. Oh, it's, you know, uh, everyone has their opinions and I really wanna share with you the best way to do it because I think some people may be using it the wrong way, having different expectations, you know, and you know, there's just, there's a lot going on. So sea salt spray to me, and early on in my career, there's been many, many brands who have had sea salt spray. And coming from the professional salon industry, when I first encountered one, I was like, this is incredible. It was so amazing. But when I would spray it, the one specific brand many, many years ago, it was just so gritty and almost like if you were pouring a beach, right, on someone's head. It was like, oh my gosh. And it was, everybody wanted to like it and like the, you know, the theory of it and the methodology of it, but it was just so intense that it was like your hair became like a sandcastle, okay? So um, it just was like, okay, I guess that's what we have to deal with. And we had to, you know, come across ways of having to use it properly and trying to get it to work just right and, you know, the right amount of spritzes. Well, over time, I guess things have shifted. And, you know, I wanted a sea salt spray that literally did not feel like a sandbox on your head, okay? Or, you know, a sand castle on your head. So what I, you know, was really interested in was finding something and creating something that literally could be that product, okay? And then Tidal Wave, was born and now to this day, it's at kind of the perfect formalization, the perfect place. And that's why it's probably my number one selling product because as a hairstylist myself for many, many years, I'm not just pulling this out of my butt, all right? I'm putting the research in, putting the development in and making sure, I mean, I've tested this so many times and made so many formula changes and scent changes to get this final product coming from knowing hair, all right? I'm, I'm not, I've said this many times, I'm not some guy sitting in like his house all day, like as a gardener who has hair products, okay? I'm literally the one testing these knowing hair, all right? So when it comes to utilizing a sea salt spray, and, and yes, there's so many sprays out there, I have no idea you know, which one's great, which one's not. All I'm focusing is on mine, but in general, when you're spraying this on, there's a few ways you can use this, okay? One, you can use it on fully damp hair, right? You get out of the shower and you spray it on, you know, you spray it on damp hair, meaning your hair is still slightly wet. You spray it on, but you have to have a style in mind. What's your purpose with your hairstyle, okay? What are you trying to achieve? If you're trying to achieve a ton of volume, use this as a support spray, a pre-styling spray to help get lift in your hair, to help get body in your hair, to help get a more matte type of texture in your hair. That's where you use sea salt spray when the hair is damp. Then you blow dry, depending on how long your hair is, your hair is doesn't, it depends on like, you know, the kind of look you're going for. If it's a shorter hairstyle, then you could literally just, while using the blow dryer, use your hands to lift to get that volume. You can use like, you know, the round brush if you're using, uh, you know, to get this, the TikToker hairstyle, which everybody is still crazing about. You know, you spray this in when it's damp, use the blow dryer, and then you need a round brush, my TikToker round brush, okay? So that's where this comes in handy. And then, you blow dry the hair using the brush and the Tidal Wave or the sea salt spray is gonna lock in that spray, okay? That's one way to do it. 
where when you blow dry, you're gonna get tons of volume. You're trying to get a lot of lift, a smoother blowout, but you want that lift and volume to support your longer hairstyle. Well, that's where this comes in as a pre-styler. Again, spray it on the hair, and you know if you're spraying it directly on the scalp, which you can, meaning you lift and spray right on the scalp area, that's really when you're gonna get the maximum volume and benefits out of this product. But I'm warning you, you're gonna have a lot of volume. <laughs> if you're using a round brush, you're gonna, your hair's gonna be full of volume, which is great for a lot of people. The next way, and how you can utilize something like this, is when the hair is a bit damp, but your hair's more on the wavy side, more on the curly side, and you don't wanna blow dry, you wanna let it air dry. This is very, very, very important. This is how I utilize this spray. I'll go in, take the spray, and I'll go one, two, three, four, maybe one on top for good luck. That's it, four to five spritzes. Then what I'll do is I'll probably just go in and scrunch the hair like this to maybe absorb the product in to really kind of tame down any sort of you know, frizz or flyaways. I'll scrunch it. Then it's a set it and forget it. I may even go back in one more time and do that, hit it with that, okay? Leave it. The problem is if you over spray this stuff, especially a sea salt spray, like it's gonna get too much. You're gonna have you know, the ocean on your head, all right? You don't wanna over spray it. It's, it's mine especially, it's not designed for that. And the newer formula does have more hold to it. It does have more of that you know, you're getting <clears throat> a lot more volume, a lot more life out of the product, so it's gonna really expand to get that volume. So you don't need a whole ton of it. You spray it on and let it settle on the hair. I've, this product, I know for a fact, 100%, I'm telling you, this will give you texture in your hair, and this will give you volume in your hair, okay? If this did not do what I'm saying it does, I would not have launched it. I would not put out a product that doesn't do what I'm saying it's gonna do. It's amazing. So with sea salt sprays in general, understand why you're using them. Another great thing is if your hair is very oily, okay, and maybe you sweat all the time and your hair just gets you know, a little bit on the greasier side or oily side and you're looking for something to kind of soak up those oils, the sea salt spray is incredible for that. Again, same thing, spray it on, scrunch it, soak it up, and it's gonna help with that, especially Tidal Wave, man. This thing is incredible. One secret that I have learned about this, and it was out of just randomness, if you spray this, and you have maybe like a shorter hairstyle, maybe like the TikToker hairstyle or something like that, and you spray this into dry hair, fully dry hair, your hair is a little bit more flat, uh, you've lost the, the volume, you wanna get it back, you have fine hair, this is incredible for fine hair. If you're looking to make your hair look thicker and you've got fine hair, <laughs> it's amazing. It binds the hair together. It makes the hair shaft expand, making it look and feel thicker. So what you can do is you spray this into dry hair and you literally work it through with your, hand, your fingers and your hands. And as you're doing that, it's gonna go from damp to then absorbing into the hair and you're gonna get all this volume and you're gonna to start to see that it's soaking up those oils. It's, inc it's like spraying on a dry shampoo with some hold. It's unbelievable, okay? If you are interested in purchasing Tidal Wave or any of my products, use code YouTube20, that's YouTube20 at shop.theslanga.com and it's free shipping on orders over $50 in the United States after the discount code is applied. So let me know if you found this video helpful, if you're using Tidal Wave, if you're using sea salt sprays, and I'll see you soon.